again. What are the expectations of God from you? Because we have come waiting to receive from God miracles beyond expectations. It is also <laughs> expecting certain things from us. For example, in 1 Peter chapter 1, from verse 18 to 19, 1 Peter 1, from verse 18 to 19, the Bible says, because you are bought with the precious blood of the Lamb, you are a very expensive commodity in the hand of the Most High. You are bought not with silver and gold, but with the blood. And he says, God expects you to glorify him with your body. The moment you're born again, you're no longer your own. You have been bought, not with silver and gold, but with the blood of the Lamb. The, your body is not your own. God expects from you that you don't use your body just anyhow. So when you hear somebody say, I can do whatever I like with my body, you know that fellow is not born again because your body is not your own. You are bought with the precious blood of the Lamb. And so God expects from you According to 1 Corinthians chapter 6, from verse 18 to 20, 1 Corinthians 6, 18 to 20, that from the moment you are born again, you flee every form of sexual immorality. Because it's not your body. <laughs> you can't do what you like with your body anymore because it belongs now the one who has paid your dowry the Lord Jesus Christ 